Roy and Lisa with Aries All In. We got another unit. We paid $170 plus buyer's premium, but let's see what we got for $170. All right, so when we were looking at the unit, you could only see this part of the doorway, right? This is actually a bigger unit than we thought, because... What we didn't see was all that over there. And what I noticed here was these stickers. They are a little blurry, but you couldn't really read it out, but this, this one right here, high threat concealment. So I'm like, oh, maybe that means something good. So one of the things we saw in the pictures that we did like, number one, these are not cheap. Like, I think this is about a $50 piece. I got a couple of them. Um, I've had to pay for a couple of them. So these are worth at least the $30 bill. You got the mantle clock. I saw the cobalt. I love these tools and the batteries. I actually have two of these at home, um, but no batteries. So um, I saw that. I know this can actually be, this is worth over $100 brand new. Didn't see this until we got here and opened the door. Like, I don't know if it's in the box, but we'll check that out in a second. There is a little bit of some military camo back there. Those saw horses really even always sell and, well in our online auction. And you can see this. Is it in there? There's, is it in there? There's what something in there. See? I think. Oh. All right. So, so let's get into this. Yeah. First, let's check this out. I got to see if something's in here and it feels a little light, but that does not mean that it's not in the unit. Oh, it's in there. Wow, okay. So this is video camera playing, remote control. So whew, we'll have to see if we have everything and that works. I saw this too, not these. This, oh, oh wow. My gosh. This has that some weight. It's loaded. What's in the backpack, guys? What do you think? Ah, uh, whoo. Well, we start off with a butane torch. Brand new. What is this? Uh, press on off is Study wire there. tracker, yeah. Beep, 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 beep. Okay. It's finding it. <laughs> so we got tools. That's what we have in here. That's why it's so heavy. Well, it's a Milwaukee bag. Right. So that makes sense that there's tools in it. It's a tool bag. And that's a good yes. thing. So I don't know what this is. Whoa, Klein Tools, that is a um, multimeter. So we're looking at some tools in here. Oh, more tools, look oh, at that, wow. loaded. Another Klein Tools, what is this? Ooh, Scout Pro. Hmm. <coughs> we'll have to look more into that. We got all kind of tools in here. Hold that flap open so they can see the whole like depth and breadth. It just goes all the way down in there. All the little wrenches and screwdrivers and so that is a good find and again i mean we only paid 170 dollars for this See, this bag right here could be worth 50 to 100 dollars mm -hmm. depends on how we parted out the bag alone is going to be worth at least 20. i'd say we yep, get a 20 dollar bill out of yeah. that i think we've sold those before yeah we have there's um, a little husky tool bucket yeah i saw this but we couldn't see what was in it what is this balance control it's some kind of tape strip yep this is a milwaukee oh is that this. a battery no is that a speaker yeah it's a bluetooth speaker and here's the battery oh wow so that actually may work and that's worth some money so oh gotta love tools again we are <laughs> no this is worth money well i love tools <laughs> right <laughs> We all have our thing, right? Oh yeah, we do. <laughs> oh, look at this, Tasco binoculars. Mm, that's good. That's what, at least a $10 bill, if not more. 20, yeah. I would say, yep. Uh, this, I mean, grab this right out of there. That is a... Yeah, what is that? That's like a humidity or temperature thing? Mm-hmm, a barometer. Gotcha. And it might be a thermometer too. But it's glass and it's not broken. <laughs> nice. <laughs> we'll try not to break that. How's that? Right. We'll set that out the way for a second. And I mean, we just have a lot in here to go through. That's an interesting bottle made in Hawaii. Oh, that's oh, organic that's that vodka. Oceanic vodka. Yep. Ocean. Ocean. But this is an empty bottle. Um, I feel like I've, we've seen that bottle before. I feel like we just bought one of these. We did. <laughs> we sure did. I bought one of those. 
So this is like that. kitchen supplies. I see hot sauce. Huh. Mm. Um, some other things in here. Another bottle of whiskey, it looks like. Hendrix. Yeah, what is this? Oh, these are tie-down okay. straps. Yeah, another bottle. This is empty, so if this is vintage, we'd have to look into that, but that could be worth some money there in itself. I don't think it is. It's Hendrix. So, we'll... So we got Velcro and we got, is this a stamps.com? Oh, this is a, it's a I don't know printer. if it's a thermal printer, but it's definitely for labels. Wow. Now the only thing we need is, it doesn't have a power cord in here. Hmm. Oh, and look, train tracks, flex track. This is uh, new in the package and it looks like it's about four of them in there. Oh, more train track stuff down here. You can see it right there. Mm-hmm. Oh, and there's a little train car. Wow. What else do we have in here? Let's see if we can lift this up a little bit. Uh-oh, we're losing stuff. Yes, we are. Looks like a lot of personal paperwork, though. Right. So, yeah, paperwork. So, well, obviously we won't go through the paperwork on camera. Um, but of course, in the paperwork, you never know what you find, so you always got to dig through it. Oh, whoa, look at that. Oh. What is that, like this a transformer? Is, yeah, Power? this is throttle control, track DC accessory. This is probably for, I don't know which track. And we but, got this. Wow, What's Union this? Pacific. Z-Scale. Three car runner pack. Oh, no okay. cars though. Okay. So, but here we got little oh. cars. There's some down in there. So oh, I wonder, is see. Z scale like the tiniest? Um, I don't know if it's the tiniest, but it obviously is tiny. <laughs> <laughs> it is tiny. Let's move this so box. This is a lot of packaging, but nothing in it yet. There we okay, go. Okay, there's some cars. Yeah, cars and some more trains. These are these don't have the wheels on them though. This one does. Here we are. Oh, that's got some weight. That's the. Is that the engine? Yes, it is. Okay. So you know that the engines always have the value, a lot of the value. So, hmm. Oh wow. So. Well, that's yeah. interesting. We Let's did see, see what's the underneath. Sign of the trains up there, but we didn't know. You never know. More paperwork. There's lots of binders. This is looks like a light. Oh yeah. Wow. What is this? This is the red market, okay. This says Civil War on it. We have people that like to collect this stuff, oh, but nothing's in it. Some paperwork. Um, we'll have to see if maybe we find the piece. What's this bag? That's probably another tool bag. Oh, there's a little train. They're so tiny, you gotta like <laughs> sort of watch for them. There we are, grab that, put it with those, and it's just an empty bag. Let's get this box out the way. Wow, we got a lot of boxes to go through here. Uh, ooh, interesting artwork. We got train tracks and trains falling everywhere. Here's a, another train right there. Here's some track over here. I think there's a, <laughs> some train wheels on the ground. They're so <laughs> tiny. Do you see that down there? Those little wheels? <laughs> Wow, we're just tut scratching the surface on this one. Here's the mantle clock. Let's move that out the way. Let's look at the back of it and see. Sometimes, is it a new one? Yeah. Oh, Suburban Clock and Repair in Berea. That's where we are. Let's see. Ooh, there's your... Is there a key? No. Um, People look for a key. I don't see a key. All right, we'll but be on the lookout for a key. That's I don't even movement. know if it needs a key. Maybe it doesn't need a key. This is not even open so hmm. let's crack this bad boy open ow that was a nail we have our handy dandy knife should never cut towards yourself so don't do like i do we'll do that as right. i say not as i do exactly what do we have in here what does the paper say um it says somebody's name on it it says raw African honey, 16 ounce limited reserve jar. And there's three of them and they're Is wrapped. Really honey in there? <laughs> okay. Yes. Wonder, what's the date on that paper? <laughs> there's really honey in there. And the date on this 
May 30th, 2019. Yikes, <laughs> we will probably not be using that honey or selling it or anything. <laughs> well, the question is, is there an expiration date on it? <laughs> Here's another priority box. What do we have in here? Has that one been opened? Oh, it has. And this is, well, bone and some tool bits. I don't know what that is. Um, it goes into an instrument, I think. Ooh, as a matter of fact. Doesn't it? Probably. It says Joe Rao Mutes. And doesn't it look like it goes into the front like of a like a trumpet or something? Or, or a cornet? Or, or, or Yeah. It's bigger than a trumpet, I would say, but I don't know. These sell too. Chainsaw chain, replacement yeah. chain. So, okay. We might find an instrument in here. Yeah. Oh, wow. Let's keep going, keep going. Here's some speakers, TCL. Here's the desktop computer. Hmm. I don't know about you all, but I don't know how you liquidate computers, but that's something we're always trying to figure out. These are little mini discs, interesting. Music, got a little screwdriver in here, earwax removal, okay. Um, if I need needs that. Yeah. Oh, I see. I see the T word. <laughs> oh, look at that. What is this? It looks like it's a faucet filter. Yeah. Main faucet filter. Okay. Yeah, it is. Is it in there? Interesting. Yep. Is it like Not only is it in there, but it's still wrapped. So it probably hasn't even been used yet. The box is just chewed up. Yeah. Not uh, literally. <laughs> okay. Train parts. Xmas train. Oh, look at that. Little industrial. Here is Union so Pacific. that's a little bit bigger, so. Yeah. Here's the transformer for it. Okay. So. So a few pieces and parts. Yeah, I'm looking to see. This is HO scale. Okay. But I'm looking to see if there's a brand on it. It's probably unbranded. Um, okay. Yeah, I don't see. I don't see a name, but nonetheless, it's still train part. Oh, oh more oh. train stuff. Wow. Nice. Oh, and it's in there. <clears throat> what is that little LG? Is that a DVD player? Probably. DVD or, yep, Blu-ray. Okay. So Those here's a nice little Blu-ray some value. Player. We have $20 bills all over the place in this unit. Right. Look at this. So this is all still, it looks still in the box. I don't know if we'd have to move that. Mm -hmm. But Bachman Easy That's Track System. scale. Wow. So one box led us to this unit. Is it all in there? What do you think? I think it's all in here. Oh, it's all in there. It's still in bags. Mm. You know, it's still wrapped. Yep. There we are. So it's all there. Track transformer. Oh, you dropped this. Which can help protect it. Thing we saw this nice little mason symbol. Mm -hmm. um, I actually thought that was a computer, but it's not a computer. But it's an interesting looking Bible with the mason symbol on it. Right. These big Bibles tend to sell. So that's a <laughs> stack see. of obviously books and Let's paper. Let's see if there's anything in that Bible. Nope, oh, personal. Yep. Wow, I just found a load of cologne. Look at that. <laughs> oh my goodness. We're loaded with the smell good in there. Ooh, and a, <laughs> who doesn't love a pizza stone? They've mm. used this a lot. It's a little rough, but... That one is rough. <laughs> get this out the way so we can get into this box down okay. here. What's in, that, what's in that bag? Shoes. Remote control. Um, that looks like a little incense thing. Mm -hmm. Char light. Yep. Yeah, a couple different pieces in there. Okay. For incense. So we cleared right. out some stuff. Wow. And like the vacuum. To get to this box right here. And what is it? We, uh, wait a minute. Let's look at this first. This okay. has some weight. <laughs> Ooh, that is a bike brand, isn't it? I think so. T H U L E bike yeah, accessory. Yeah, because well, you see a lot of like uh, ooh, like ooh. The, the car top carriers. What oh is yeah. Oh, is <laughs> look. That a little laptop. Yeah, a little Lenovo. That's a good brand. That's an ornament for Hershey's. Look at this. These are glasses. I mean, it's loaded with stuff. I don't even know what this is. Is that a brick of cheese? It's a brick of something. <laughs> Cigars? I don't know. All right, all right, now I gotta open it and see. 
Uh, Tabasco. Oh. Wow. It's a Tabasco, <laughs> like, special edition or something. Yeah, but here's <laughs> the thing. Like, there's a couple of them down here. Oh, okay. So here's another one. Oops, same box. All right, we won't open those. Well, we'll have to open them at, at some point. But. There's that. Wow, somebody liked their Tabasco. I like hot sauce. Me, I'm a... Looks like there's another computer in there, too. Yep. I'm a trapeze kind of guy, but, uh... Push looks, comes the shove, you would eat it. Oh, yeah. This will definitely, if it's not expired, be in the collection. <laughs> it won't stay wrapped for long. Yep, here's another computer. Oh, Ooh. it's a MacBook. It's kind of thick. It looks older. Yeah, but it's still a <laughs> Today, MacBook. they're about a quarter of an inch thick. MacBook Pro, so... Hmm. Yeah, that's a, that's a good find. Yes, it is. I had an Apple or a Mac computer for a long time. Yep. And then there's some paperwork, so I'm not going to dig all of it out. Yeah, that was a... Whew. So we wanted to get to this box because it looks like it's never been opened. Yeah, but this was right on top, so I had to move it. And uh, why not look at it? Yes. <laughs> all right. Okay, what is this here? Oh, man. I'm looking at it, and I think this is a... Oh, it's got some weight. Oh man, this thing has some weight. Oh. Look how big it is. And there's another box back here. Deluxe okay, canister okay, steam okay. system. Okay, we want to see what this is. We're getting there. What is it? We're it's a getting... 10 inch variable speed MIDI lathe. Nice. Wow, and Ooh. it's brand new. We're not even opening it. I no. mean, we're gonna sell it this way. I mean, it's still, wow, that thing has some weight. Whew, I bet you this is worth $170. Oh, I, oh, definitely. Brand new in the box. Wow, huh. I think we need to put that on the cart, but let's get into this. <laughs> Check this out. There's another box down here. And then I see train boxes. Oh. And look, we're, we're just barely scratching like the just surface. stepped into the unit. <laughs> <laughs> we're just barely scratching the surface. Okay. All right. All right. Next stack. Next stack. Well, we kind of already looked at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's like a little stool. Oh, no. Total gym. That's what that's oh, for. Oh, it's a piece of equipment. Yeah. The back. Um, there are, these are to the TV, which I don't know if it's in here. Um, That's good to know, though, in case yeah. we do come across the TV, we'll know we have the legs. Or there's another unit somewhere, and uh -oh. we didn't get it. This is empty. It's just a backpack. Okay. Yeah. Leather. Looks like it might be leather, though. I don't know. Look at this. What do we have in here? Ooh, ooh, scope. <gasps> oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's not Leopold, but... uh. That could be worth some money right there. We don't know how much it's new, but wow. Digital caliper, so we got more tools. That says insignia. What is this? It says K-Tronic. Let's pull that out. Can it's you like Lead free. Is it a, some kind of scale? Like it has a little digital readout. Yeah. And some buttons maybe something sits on i don't know yeah we'll have to look it up i'm feeling like that could be a scale for if it's a scale what i'm thinking lay it free maybe for doing uh ammo mm, ammunition. That's, yeah that's what it reminded me of um Not that i know what those look like but we sold a couple of them recently <laughs> oh, tools gotta love them uh, we need more of those little things around the warehouse. I never have a tiny screwdriver when I need one. Oh, there's one easily accessible. I just got to show you where it's at. It, what, in the tool chest? <laughs> no, it's actually <laughs> right at the counter. Yeah, I know. What's underneath all this? Clothes. <sighs> it's a laundry basket. Okay. <laughs> yeah. sure it's all clothes. But, you know, um, we'll have to really dig through this and... That's always the thing. You never know what's hidden in clothes. Yep. But, uh, you know, we'll have to dig through that later. Yeah. Because what did oh, we find in coats the last that's time? That's what it is. Extronic soldering station. Okay. So that's what that piece was. What did, what did we find in clothes recently? Well, actually, it was coats. We found a Nintendo Switch. 
and all its parts and accessories. Completely buried. We would have never even gotten to it when we were recording the, the unit. Because we don't generally go through and dump out the clothes. We've got so much to go through. We got over here, this is a corner shelf for the kitchen, some plates. We got knives and you gotta check out, this is Chicago Cutlery, that's oh, a good brand. Ooh. That's one of my favorite brands. That's, it's look, not the most high end, it's but. It's the whole thing, oh. the whole set, wow. You got your steak knives and you got your nice little. I love Chicago Cutlery. Bread knife, oh, you even got nice little sharpeners, so wow, that's worth it. And here's UV Pro Elite Shoe Sanitizer. A shoe sanitizer that's um, interesting this is so kind of like remember phone soap yeah uv light you stick it in the shoe to kill out the oh, bacteria okay. in the shoes i don't know if that would work on your shoes yours are probably too far gone but. whatever whatever <laughs> people can you believe she just said my feet stink <laughs> But hey, we'll take it. We'll, we'll try anything at this point. <laughs> Look under here. We have multi-tool or, yeah, multi-tool. I'm sorry, angle grinder. We got Craftsman sockets down here. Don't drop that on my toe. <laughs> <laughs> what else? Looks like books, magazines. This is a coffee maker. Cuisinart. And then we got... Is that some art? Footprints. There's footprints. Oh, that's um, a good one. Oh, here's a good one right here. That'll sell well. These always sell well. Oh, yeah. It's like an F, F20 Tiger Shark, it says. Yep. So military plane pictures sell well for us. Um, and I'm just trying to be careful to make sure. Oh, here's another one. Look at that. That's upside down, but it's not personal. That looks like... Air Force. Oh, those are nice. Though, yeah. yeah, those are very nice. Now that, that one that's personal. personal. Yep. All right. So. All right, got to get this little cart. It's a cart on its side. Is it? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because there's the wheels on the bottom. <laughs> but right so. now it's loaded with stuff. Yeah, so let us get this out of here so we can have a little more room. Um, but actually... Before that, I saw these two. We already mentioned those, but here's. Oh, oh. these are a different kind. These aren't exactly. Um, okay. What are those? Why can I never remember the name? Saw horses. Of those? Saw horses. So, these are a little different, and I was wondering so about it's the pole. Almost like a portable table, because you open it up, and then that's the top yeah. of the table. That other piece. That. Un, you unhook and then put it on there it is huh huh interesting yeah okay a table or i don't know it probably has a more specific purpose but this is probably a work table and know. then there's another one back there but it doesn't have that um flat top part right in the middle Maybe it fell off, so we'll have to see if it's somewhere in here. Let's go ahead. Well, we're not going to be able to grab that. But there was another thing here, which I can't wait to get to it. We're almost to it. Yeah, here's your nice jacket here. It's like a rain jacket, almost. Like it is, actually. Windproof. Military. I just noticed this. Did you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> can't wait to get to that. Well, you didn't notice what I noticed, which is what I'm about to get to. No. All What's right. on top of it? All right. All right, hold on. It's right Thank here. Thank you so much. I'm so excited. What is ah. it? <gasps> yeah, it's a French horn, maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Ah. No, 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 not a French horn. Uh, there it is. A sousaphone. Is that what it's called? A tuba. <gasps> it's not a tuba. Tubas are huge. <laughs> a baritone. Oh my gosh, I was in band for eight years and I can't remember. But I played a clarinet, so I was not in the <laughs> You in weren't the in the... Uh, I wasn't yeah. in the brass, but that is what that thing goes to. Yes. So, That's awesome. <laughs> and that is an instrument right there. Those sell well for us. Yes, we do well with instruments. Yeah. Oh, we have some... We have those keyboards. We have a guitar. Mm-hmm. We have... Uh, 
Got quite a few things coming up in the next warehouse liquidation sale. Yep. Oh, 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 oh. oh careful. All right. Okay. Here we are. <gasps> Do you need a hand? Do you want me to grab this? Oh my gosh, it's, it's a weed whacker. That's what Ooh. it is. There it is, the POW. Oh. That's what this is. Hmm. So, we have signs of military. Yep. We found a 1984 platoon class for parasailing Marine Corps. And look at this. This is trains. That's a whole set. This is kitchen utensils, but what's this? This is an interesting box here. Hamilton Beach carved knife. and set. Oh. Electric knife. Look at that. Maybe, just maybe, we could use that for Thanksgiving. Or we'll probably sell it. <laughs> Are you cooking the turkey? <laughs> Let's set that down. Grab this out the way now. Yeah, let's pull this out because it's so big and a little fragile. Like, I mean, wow. the box is a little. Look at that. We got the cars in there. Where's the engine? Um, see the engine. It might be. Well. Well, we'll have to look at this closer. We don't want to take yeah. it all apart now because it's. Yeah, we'll have to pull it apart and at the warehouse um but that definitely has potential because it could still be in the unit right it doesn't have to be in the box it oh, could yeah. be somewhere in here and look at all the stuff we still have to go through yes wow this is an unopened box here oh boy <laughs> i'm nervous <laughs> like oh and it's got some weight to it we're gonna open that in a second because then there's this one i saw as the pile was starting to fall on me oh there's the table top see yeah what is that a lathe duplicator that's Another still in the box brand new in the box woodworking so we haven't so we haven't come across any woodworking smaller tools but we got those two big tools yeah here's another coat this is actually this is pretty heavy winter coat right here that coat looks amazingly warm um the names on it i bet it is amazingly warm what is this Smithsonian Motor Works, but I don't think this is part of the motor. <laughs> Looks like an angel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it definitely isn't uh, part of the motor. But we'll get into, we'll have to look at that and figure that out in a little bit. Oh man, there's just a lot of train stuff down here. Wow. We're digging into all of this. What is that? This is for your TV antenna pole. Okay. Um, there's a shelf. Ooh, we're gonna have to clean that up in a second. Here's a sound bar. Yep. I I don't know if this goes with that speaker we found. Um, oh, or it if was it's the just same name though, right? Right. GCL. Yeah. Oh, it's Bluetooth as well. <laughs> we do well with those too. Yeah. That's your piece for your TV. I'm really trying to get down to these trains down here. Here's your Charlie Brown Christmas tree musical. <laughs> the box the, looks as sad yeah. as the tree. <laughs> I was just going to say that, too. Okay, look. Oh, man. There's a small box sliding. Okay, look at that. This is here in the engines in it. The Foodland Express 2000 HO scale electric train set. That looks like it's never been out of the box. Wow. And then what's underneath it? Shop and save. Smart Shopper Express. Here's the engine. It's all in here. That's all in there. What's the date on that? There's a date. I can't see it. 1988? 1998. Okay. Here's another one. And this is the year 2000. Yep. Still in there, so and wow. And then you didn't even show this one. But there's another one underneath there. Yeah, I did. No. You didn't no? show this one. No. <laughs> no? No. Wow. Upside down, but... <laughs> <laughs> 
So four brand new train sets. In the box. Brand new in the box. Wow, wow, okay. <laughs> Hey, if you're still watching, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up. Now let's hope that this is clean because you never know what you're going to get when you open a refrigerator. Clean and empty. <laughs> Uh-oh. Nah, it's clean. Almost. I mean, eh. yeah. yeah, it's, it's as, is as clean as it could be coming out of a storage yeah, unit. Yeah, and it doesn't smell. That's the big thing. Yeah, and we do pretty well with these little fridge. Yeah, this little is... refrigerators. So now we can kind of see back here, got a lot of garbage bags back there. I wonder what all that is. I mean, oh, that's I don't hard. Think it, I don't think it's, got it's all clothes. in there. That's clothes or something, cloth. There's the TV. There's a box. Oh, let's get into this. Yes, we got so much more to go through. Here's a no spill coolant filling um, tools. There we are. This is for like uh, siphoning brake lines. This is a tire patch plug, so that's what's in here. We got another battery and charger. This is for tires. These are for plug-in tires. Got Hopefully enough of those. Tires in here. <laughs> this says progressive on it. Progressive electronics, hmm, inductive amplifier. Interesting, I wonder how much that could be worth. We'll have to check that out. And All these little tools that are 10 to $20 bills. And yeah. this is the camera. Oh. Ooh, we got the Nikon. You know, you gotta check these cameras out because some of these are worth a lot of money. Cool Picks 885. Okay. And what's in this one? This Another one's a Nikon Cool Picks 4800. So, okay. yeah, I'm trying to think where did I, were we looking at these cameras? And they, I mean, this could be worth, depending. I, I looked at a camera yesterday that was worth over $100. Let me move this out the way. We can take this whole shelf with everything on it in a second. But this has some weight. So either it's got the logger in it or. It's got something else. All right, my guess is something else. <laughs> what is this? This is a Wheeler Engineering 220 grit. Well, I think this might be for a lathe. Yep. There's your picture. These are your points to hold the wood. Okay. Now that fits with the other pieces we pulled out. Yeah, and it's got some weight, so that could be worth some money. Look at this, another scope. Mm. I feel something. Yep, yep. Are we going to find a pew pew? That is the question. I know. Oh, it's still wrapped. It's in here. Wow. You know, um, and these can sell for hundreds of dollars, depending. Oh, here we it's are. Military pack Looks like a, type. Probably the ammo. Waste. Ammo pouch. Yeah. Pouch. So, pack. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, wow. You never know what we will find, that is for sure. Wow. That would be nice. This is a for a 12 gauge. So there's definite signs, but you know, who knows? See, here's a nice little holster, but <laughs> wow. Is that another scope? Yep, Red Star. Again, mm -hmm. I mean, scopes sell. Like, you'd yes. be surprised at how well some of them can sell. There's a, and oh, then we got flashlight. two flashlights, yeah. <laughs> So that's what's in here. Right. Nice little logger box. I mean, this here could be a $100 box. Yeah. Oh, and then we got the nice little Coke cooler. Woohoo! Man, if only we had this already. Oh, it's got to be plugged in, but that would have been nice to have our Coke in here already. So when we're done, we have something cold to drink. All right. But thankfully, we brought our water bottle. <laughs> so we got this nice little desk here. Ooh, got some look. outlets here. Nice. Anything in the drawer besides directions? No. Nope. Drawers are empty, but that works. Under the desk, that's what I want to know. A little knee brace. These are always nice little fuses for the car. We got wire connectors. What is this? Oh man. Oh, this is for a tap and die set. If this is, oh, it's not even open, that is money right there. Wow. That's a good, probably uh, $15, $20. 
How many of these can we collect? <laughs> I know. These are not all nasty and rusty like they usually are, so those are nice. Well, the ones that aren't nasty and rusty we sell. <laughs> oh. Yes, those are definitely nice. We have what's here. I'm not sure what the, oh, this is a little. Oh, like a tool cart? Like, do you store yeah. things in there? I want to say a tool cart, but somehow it pops up. It looks like maybe. It has a ha handle, but. Hmm. This is interesting. Yeah. I might have to look Does at this. Does this open here? Yep, there we go. But what, what does it do? <laughs> just comes off oh okay probably this might be something for the wall and then What's you put your there? parts in here a little parts bin you know and you can hang this on the wall and you can take this with you if you need oh, it oh gotcha okay that's what i'm figuring All right. tricky it's tricky yep but that's still interesting oh this is a tackle box wow that's a nice one it's like we got so much fishing stuff and I haven't been out fishing. I gotta get out fishing and here's some more, you know. Another knife, fishing knife. Knife, little multi tool. Look at these. Look at those. Wow. Man. We actually, this reminds me, we have to get all that fishing stuff that we have in the corner of the warehouse <laughs> into the sale. Right. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, it's time of year. so much fishing stuff. Look what at this. Under there? Ooh, that's it's a, a little, little rolling. Little thing, but yeah. The net gear, that's going to be money. Unopened. Unopened. This is a little knee brace. These are pretty cool. Ever lock your keys in the car? <laughs> that what one's a little... That? You slide it in between the door and you pump it open so that you can get a wire in there to oh, unlock your door. Okay. And then that little rolling seat. Oh, man. And another tool bag. A Milwaukee tool bag. Wow. And it's got some heavy, weight. Yeah. According to Roy's grunt. So here's your husky. What's in this? Whoa. We got, it looks like screwdriver set and screwdrivers. Okay. And of course they all just fell over. <laughs> so let's <laughs> <go ahead. laughs> So you can't get it back in the same way you pulled it out? We'll get it in. <laughs> See, it's in. Yes. These are your Ryobi little, oh, drill bits there. That's drill bits. Maybe this, these are your little socket pieces. Little hex bits, yep, there they are. And they're, it's complete, like usually. Well, you're missing one right okay. there. <laughs> but usually there's like three things left in there. Oh yeah. my gosh. And we got a drill to go with it. Wow, okay, okay. Dremel parts and pieces. DeWalt, more drill bits. Ooh, we. Yeah, this, oh, 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 Milwaukee, this is a reciprocal saw. Wow, little battery operated handheld. Oh man, this here, this is a good bag. Mm -hmm. Gotta love the tools, gotta love the tools. And then what's this last piece down here? Uh, Tapcon Pro Installation Kit. So Tapcon, these are, this is actually a drill bit piece, but Tapcon is, uh, they make a lot of those um concrete anchors so if you need to put a screw or something in concrete oh, okay that's one of the brands that you know you would buy gotcha i think that might be this bag could be worth 170 dollars i know I mean, everything like i mean it's just crazy there's money everywhere in this unit dollar bills raining dollar bills you can see we have a lot of stuff still to go through um there's bags there's more boxes there's tons of stuff to go through so we're gonna go ahead and wrap this up with this last box that i've been promising we'd get to and then we're just gonna i mean it's just a lot to go through we're gonna have to get back to you with more um but let's wrap this up real quick I promise we'd look and see what's in here. It's brand new in the box. So what do we have in the box though is the question. And I see oh, more boxes. What do you think? I have no idea. More boxes. Oh. <laughs> well, here's the box. Um, live tailstock drill chuck. Oh, there's a whole bunch of stuff in here. Yes, it is. 
Woodworking. PSI woodworking products. This is probably wood for working. <laughs> Get wood it? For woodworking. <laughs> um, so funny. What's in this box here? Oh, this is a tool. There we go. Five inch bench top disc sander. So new all in the of box. This stuff is brand new because the box was never opened. So right. Everything in here is brand new. Exactly. Like wow. Look at all these parts and pieces. Ideal for pen making. I mean, six inch grit sanding system. Look at all this. A squaring jig. Salt and pepper kit. <laughs> really? Yes. Right, this box right here. Oh. <laughs> we might need that because our little pepper shaker at home, the bottom thing is uh, leaking pepper. All right, so again, if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe for more. We still have more of this unit to get through, so see you soon.